A manhunt is underway after a deadly shootout in the heart of the Las Vegas Strip. NBC's Miguel M. Maguire is there with more. Miguel. Carl, good morning. Police are coming through mounds of surveillance tape trying to ID their suspects. They say this all began in a parking lot area, then spilled onto the street just behind me. Mayhem on the Vegas Strip. A car fully engulfed in flames moments after a wild shooting. Three killed in a scene described by witnesses as something that looked like a Hollywood set. There was a few second delay, maybe two or three seconds. Then I heard a series of gunshots. Police say it all began with a confrontation between a group of men at the Aria Hotel Valet parking area. Soon they were on the Vegas Strip. The suspects in a black Range Rover, the victims in a gray Maserati. Police say a man opened fire from the moving SUV, hitting the Maserati driver, who sped through an intersection, colliding with several cars, including a taxi that burst into flames. Two inside the cab killed in the explosion. The driver of the Maserati, identified by his family as Ken Cherry, also dead. With the heart of the Vegas Strip shut down much of Thursday, police launched a multi-state, multi-agency manhunt. Investigators say if their suspects ever entered a hotel, it's quite likely that they're captured on uh, camera. They also say their manhunt now has entered 24 hours, and they will likely close in on their suspects sometime soon. Carl. Miguel Almaguer in Las Vegas. Miguel, thanks.